now we will select this one go to strip width click on this we can click here or in this case we will edit this by length right this update and for this one click on this click this we will go to this point update close now for y direction we will draw same y direction this to this this to this this to this and here to here okay now in this way we can draw the column strips and for middle strip we'll draw same way x we will write 1000 okay from here press control to make it vertical here from here to here from here to press control to make it vertical 90 degree okay done and for y direction click here to here here to here here to here okay now for this one we will adjust this to this sorry click on this then pick update this click this update for this one update click on this again this update close select this one and this click on this and click this point update again select this cursor then click this point update close now select this one this is okay for this one this one also okay this one select and go to strip option click on it and up to this we want to extend update and click again this one click this point update close so now our strip drawing has been perfect now we will go to raft finite elements raft foundation analysis okay 
now we will run this one ok generate model done ok here are the subgrade modulus subgrade, soil subgrade coefficient 50,000 kilonewton per meter cube this subgrade modulus we can calculate from the soil properties which I have shown in the foundation design in safe in matte foundation design in safe CSI safe in previous tutorials in my channel you can see that now and now this is post processing so here are the strips showing ok here we can see the analysis result we can see the strip results span strip and we can pick the strip this one in this strip we can see the results a shear force diagram moment diagram and required steel it is calculating here all the stations generating the result for 66 stations in 25 number of widths this here are the moment showing design moment this one required steel area this all you can see and you can see in table also so close this one now we will go to see the reinforcement design we have provided the reinforcement before and strip wise it will be designed now close this one and include in strip result ok and consider plate torsion effect wood and armor in slab design moment this one we will unmark ok now transferring slab strip result in our model from the model we can see the reinforcement result this is the post processor and this result processing result it will be transferred to our main window of Prota so this has been finished this takes some time to calculate all the strip results now it close this one here are the active window settings visual interrogation fe counter here in previous time we have seen this in the view and here we will now we will see the reinforcement click set none So now we will see the reinforcement result. Aaron is still bar, update is still bars. Now here. So 
so this is the reinforcement in strips strip wise it has been designed the reinforcement this button in the first time we will not get here in that case we will go to this history here you will see the slab this one then this one you select and update this steel bar then automatically we will get this arrange steel bar option here in prota if the foundation thickness is not enough then it will not design the reinforcement it will show the warning so in this case this foundation thickness is enough for this structure that's why it has been uh, passed in reinforcement design and now we can see the analysis result okay slab analysis and design this one check design design do not modify existing steel this is still it will not modify it will check the design and from here we can see the report the foundation design report this is the slab reinforcement design here are the report so in this way we can create pdf also in this way we can design raft foundation in prota structure suite we will generate drawing so in, from this plan if we go to the prota details this total details is opening this has been opened now if, if we create drawing here this we will deselect draw now the drawings has been generated see with the reverse and here are the schedules schedules this drawing we can export into dwz okay export this is exporting now exported completed open drawing is opening so this is the drawing this is the reverse and drawing in the AutoCAD so in this way we can design this one moment and this this is the chair river here are the soil parameters code and this is the river schedule bill of quantity 
so in this way we can design draft or map foundation in prototype structure and we can generate we can generate drawing also so thanks for watching subscribe my channel stay tuned and get notified by clicking on the bell button press the bell icon on the youtube app and never miss another update